Hey everybody, I'm here today to share with you a project that I made for my mom for Christmas. It is an altered Tim Holtz configuration tray. <clears throat> and I bought the tray at Michael's and I think they're like $14.99. Um, so I wanted to go with like a theme, well, a colors that would match her, her, um, living room. Sorry, I got something in my throat. <coughs> Excuse me. And so I left the base, the color that it came, the cream color, because it would go good with everything. So what I wanted to do basically was um, use pictures of um, her kids, which would be me and my three brothers, and her grandkids. And I have one son, and my oldest brother has two kids. So I wanted to incorporate pictures of all of us into the theme and I wanted to kind of give it a vintage feel to it and I really <coughs> excuse me oh my goodness I really haven't had a whole lot of mojo lately so it's kind of been a struggle to get this done just with everything that's been going on I just my mojo just kind of disappeared um, I'm not for sure if I'm completely done with this but I just wanted to make sure I get this video done because she's been coming over a lot and baking and I don't want her to end up seeing it. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to show you guys real quick. Um, this is what it looks like. These are pretty big trays, as you can see. So, I'll start over here. <coughs> Excuse me. So, this is my brother. This is my oldest brother. And these are his two kids. This is my nephew and my niece. Um... And I just kind of added some vintage lace inside and around the whole thing I put some lace. Um, this all right here I put, this is all vintage lace and I used some flatback pearls on it. Um, this next one is my three brothers. So this is my older brother and these two are my younger brothers. And this is my youngest brother. And this little box right here I put a flower. And you can't really see it, but there's a paper doily piece back there, and there's this little clock and this little bottle that has some white glitter in it. And then there's this little box here. <coughs> oh my goodness, my throat is all of a sudden acting up. And um, here I use some more vintage lace that I've just been hoarding for a while, but I thought what a good place to use it on this box. And like this piece and these stickers, there were... Um, some epoxy stickers and they were kind of transparent so like on this one and this one I backed it on some white cardstock so that it wouldn't be see-through and that's what I did with that here's a another one this is my mom and that's my son Diego you guys all know him and um, that's them this was at Easter I took all these pictures off my mom's Facebook page and um, had them printed up so this is another picture of my three brothers and this is they're at my brother's house they hang out a lot I never hardly see them <laughs> they're always like hanging out together um, this right here is there's some rosette trim in here and there's a, a vintage looking cameo and like I said I wanted to go with like a vintage feel to it and then this next one right here I use some paper doily edging and you can see in there that's a picture of my son um, it's kind of, well, it's late here right now, so it's kind of dark, so that's why the lighting's not so great, but I'll lay this tray down flat when I'm done, so you can kind of get a better idea, more light, but then it also has a glare, so that's why I have it up like this. <coughs> this next box has some more vintage lace in it inside, and then I added some pearls and some flowers, another little clock piece. And this other piece that says captured in time and a little flower right there and then this one um, I just made this flower here and add another one of the stickers from the set and it says time stand still and then this one <laughs> this is another piece from the set right here and I backed this one on some cardstock because it was clear and added this flower and a little bit of black pearls and this is not a very good picture at all um, it was taken in my craft room and it, the lighting in there is horrible but this is me and that's my son this was taken a few months ago 
Um, yeah. <laughs> and then I made this flower right here out of the same trip, trip, trim that's <laughs> around the box. And I added this vintage style button on there. And I, make, I liked it because it had the black center. <clears throat> so this next one right here, this is my son. You can see he's so cute. Yeah. And then this is my niece. And she's 12 years old. She just turned 12 in August. She's like five foot ten. It's crazy, insane. Um, this is my stepdaughter Bella, and this they were this was taken on Halloween. Um, before we went out, we we took a bunch of pictures, and this is them. And then there's this box here, and this uh, was a ring that I had bought. Um, I just took the bottom circle part off, and I really liked it. It's really cute. And I wanted to have some bling in there, so I just glued that in there. So, I showed you guys this one already, but this is my niece. This is my older brother, um, my niece. She's so tall. This is my nephew. He is, um, like, 15, and he's seriously, like, 6 foot 5. It's insane. And my brother, who's, he's, like, 6 foot 4, so, I mean, that's no surprise there. But then you see me, and I'm, like, 5 foot 4. <laughs> And my three brothers are all over six feet tall. But I'm kind of glad because I don't want to be tall. <laughs> but anyways, um, so this this picture right here was on the side of this picture and I, when I had cut it. And I didn't want to, like, because I wanted to put these together because, you know, my brother and his kids. Um, so this is my youngest brother. So I just added that piece in here because I needed a little picture for it. Um, like, these were all taken at Easter. Um, and this box right here is just a big pink flower and two little flowers. And then that's my brother, my youngest brother again, and my mom. And then um, here I have another shadow box with cameo, vintage style cameo. And then that's um, a picture of my brother too. Um, he doesn't have any kids, so only me and my older brother have kids. My two younger brothers don't. Um, this is the first one of these I've done, and like I said, it's been kind of hard because I really haven't had any mojo to do anything. <coughs> Excuse me. But I finally got it done. I'm not sure exactly, like, if I want to put more stuff to it or not, but in case I don't, I just wanted to get the video up. So I'm going to try and lay this down so you guys can kind of have a better view of it and some better light. So I'm going to go over again, and I'm sorry if there's glare. So let me kind of zoom out real quick. So that's basically what it looks like. And I'll come in again and show you guys everything. <clears throat> no, so that's all of them. Sorry for the shakiness. That's everybody. So that's my tray. I hope my mom likes it. I hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think. Yeah, and if you could see, I only added one picture of me because I do not take pictures. I hate taking pictures. It's just a thing I have. And um, But I took that one because I wanted to have pictures of my mom's kids and her grandkids incorporated into this. And she would probably be kind of pissed off, at, or excuse me, mad <laughs> if... Um, I wasn't in there somehow, so um, I did that one. So yeah. What? Post your ideas down in the comments below. <laughs> okay. Diego wanted in on this action, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's my tray. Let me know what you guys think, and thank you for watching. Bye.